that I usually talk about the process of things because it's very much behind the scenes, right? What we see are usually the titles, you know, what you do, but I really want to know what goes into the process of what you do. How do you accumulate so much information? How do you deliver the information yeah. so well? I mean, a lot of work goes into it because yeah. uh, there's a lot of people, especially in our communities, think that you can get somewhere while cutting corners. You can't. Uh, everything requires preparation. I, uh, from a very young age, I noticed a lot of people in our community would feel passionately about an issue like Palestine or whatever it is, and you'd see them go on TV, and they were horrible. They were really bad at expressing themselves or making the argument, and they, we would lose. We as Muslims would see people on TV, but say, oh, I'd rather they, they don't go on a Muslim spokesperson, because they're really bad. And that's because we haven't prepared enough. We haven't done the reading. We haven't done the prep work. We haven't done the research. We haven't understood the arguments of our opponents. Number one thing we don't do, we read confirmation bias. We read just our own side of the argument and say, wow, I have all this information and facts. And then we go to debate with someone or argue with someone and they introduce an argument that you never came across. Yeah. How do I rebut because that? Because you didn't bother. Because you didn't bother to find out the other side. You need yeah. to know that John Stuart Mill once said you cannot know your own side of the argument unless you know the other side of the argument. So that's a kind of big guide for me when I do my TV interviews, for example. Me and my team, we go through that interviewees, all their previous interviews. We watch right. them. We understand what their arguments are going to be. We're familiar with their talking points. Yeah. So when that interviewee sits down with me, I know that when I ask them a question, if they start telling some story that they've told seven times before, yeah. I'm ready to rebut that story because actually that story is not accurate because I've done the homework. So you do have to do a lot of work. You do have to do a lot of reading. We live in an age of hot takes and social media, easily right. distracted. Actually, you do have to put the hard work in, read the long articles, read the transcripts, do the homework.